in Matthew 2 verse 10, the Bible says, when they saw the star, they saw the star. You know, people have always asked questions, which star did the wise men see? Let me break the silence all the years. Every man has his own star. Praise God. And your star can be seen in the sky. Are you following me? I know it's, as an African, it's easy to believe because in African church, there's a lot of prayer against and go bo water bo da wami mole. Hey ya, oh ya, you know, go bo water bo da wami mole. Oh ya, catch fire, you know. That kind of prayer is common in African church, so it's easier for you to embrace what I just said. But I can show you theologically from the Bible. Every man has his own star. They located Jesus' star. Ah ya, they couldn't cover it, but they located it. It means it doesn't matter where you are, the people can locate your star. Are you following me? Good. Ah. Lord Jesus. Let me go off a little. Many times, your star has an assignment. One of the assignments of your star is to bring helpers to you. So when an helper is looking for you, where are you? Where is this man? Where is Shola? Where is Festus? The helper looks for your star. When he finds your star, the star keeps leading him in that direction and starts okay, turn right. Now turn left. Now that is where he is. They say, okay, well, please, who is Festus? I want to give him 20 million. Uh, yes. Hallelujah. Your star has the assignment to give direction. Direction. To helpers that are looking for you. But so if he has the ability to give direction to the helpers that are looking for you, an angel of darkness can clothe himself as light and say, I am his helper. And he will also follow your star. Look for you. And do you even? May that not happen to you? Yeah. Are you following me? 